And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Brentford facing Manchester City. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. Joao Cancelo. The ball with Rodri. City move it forward with purpose. Not able to put it behind for what will be a corner here. They favoured a short one here. Gundogan. Can they get themselves in front here? He's gone and found the net! Brilliant piece of finishing! Magnificent goal! Well, here's the replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box, just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it, while the movement in the box is equal to it. It's such good timing. What a goal. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Janelt. Well, it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? We're going to see the first yellow card of the game. The referee not standing on ceremony. Well, he's under pressure now. It's a long time to be on a booking. And still dangerous. Oh, wonder goal! Right out of the top drawer. Who could do better than that? Well, when you see this again, the defending just isn't good enough. The clearance doesn't get enough height on it, doesn't get enough distance on it, and suddenly the ball's being played back into their danger area and they don't reorganise themselves, and that's why the ball's in the back of their net. Back underway, level pegging, one goal apiece in this game. Joao Cancelo... Phil Foden now great effort to keep that one in play now a potentially dangerous position for City it certainly wasn't a clean tackle and the referee has got to book him I think and following the infringement a caution yeah no surprise there that was always going to be a booking He'll take this on. Well, you might say, taking everyone by surprise, he didn't miss by much. Well, this is all about his technique. The ball seems to gather pace the closer it gets to goal. That's a really good effort.
giving the ball away. De Bruyne. Gabriel Jesus. Foden. He drives it in. Oh, my goodness! He's caught that so well! A goal of the highest class. Fantastic technique. Well, let's look at this again. The cross just couldn't be any better, could it? Whipped into that danger area, and it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. So back underway at 2-1. Tight contest here. Frank Onyeka. And he's in. Less than can... He can't hold on to it. Well, they can't quite take advantage in the end. This corner could be useful to them. Well, they won't get too many chances, so they need to make the most of this. Playing it in, taking care of business defensively here. Can he convert? And that's a straightforward stop. Foden. Gundogan. De Bruyne now. Joao Cancelo. City moving the ball forwards. What can they do from here? Well, no pressure on the keeper. Poor cross. Christian Nurgard. Wissa has it. Ball's gone. Gundogan. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Possession given away by Gabriel Jesus. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. This could square the game, but the keeper has his say. And how important could that be in the grand scheme of things? Well, that was a big chance, and really, he should have taken that. But let's give credit to the goalkeeper. It's a decent save. Mares. On to Jesus. So three minutes of stoppage time coming up. Foden Gabriel Jesus and what a magical save it was now sending it in a very effective clearance Jesus Foden has someone to play it to a very effective challenge put in and with that the first half draws to a close well he's been the standout for his side so far don't you think Stuart well I really liked his first half display he was certainly the most influential player on the field and I'm expecting more of the same in the second 45 minutes Well, advantage City after the first 45 minutes, but a long way from being decided. A super tackle, and they've won possession. Christian Nurgard. Wissa has it. At times, they make passing look easy. 
But attacking possibilities. It's opening up for them. That was perfectly timed, and it is going to be a corner. Well, the crowd are doing their bit. Can they find the equaliser here? Over it comes. So a goal kick is what's coming up here. Rodri and now Stones Foden Phil Foden now crisp tackling Sergi Canos here's Nurgard Moving the ball nicely, trying to carve out the equaliser. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? And he's broken free! And not at all problematic for the goalkeeper. Christian Nurgard. Henry he's enjoying space and teammates to play it to could be troublesome it might be on for them gives it a go and the keeper got there And Manchester City will go to their bench. Number 47, Phil Foden. To be replaced by number 7, Raheem Sterling. And over comes the corner. On well, the corner, too close to the goalkeeper that time. Well, on the cusp of full time, the home side keep plugging away but find themselves on the wrong end of the scoreline. Stuart, your thoughts on what you've seen? Well, it's been close, but I'm not sure they deserve anything from this game. They've just not created enough clear-cut chances. There's still time, though. They just need to get the ball into the danger area. The referee has decided to give the free-kick decision the way of City. So making the substitution now. Delivered into the box. A decisive clearance it was. Well, wasted opportunity here. Would have been a decent chance, but offside the verdict. Ten minutes to go. Jansson. Can they fashion something? They need a goal. Tariq Fosu. 
Oh, moving it nicely. Terrific block. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Can they keep it going? Gundogan. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Gabriel Jesus! Well, flinging himself at the ball. Another goal from this corner would in all likelihood secure a victory. And time for the change now. Who can he pick out? Well, did his job defensively. Setting off perhaps a little bit too much here. Gabriel Jesus. And the keeper making sure that was pushed well away from danger. Well, the players should be inspired by this. The crowd have really got behind them today. Well, do they have a goal in their future? They're giving it a go. Ivan Toni. And he read it well. And there goes the final whistle. It's gone the wrong way as far as the home fans are concerned. Well, Derek, it was a poor result, but it was a really tight contest. Both sides had their chances, could have gone either way, but in the end, they will be disappointed. Well, there's a sound reason why we're focusing on him. He's made his presence felt in attack, Stuart. Well, he was a major reason why they won today. He was so reliable and he inspires those around him.